Good morning, guys. This is your friendly machine shop math guy. I'm going to give you a little demonstration on the peripheral speed of a standard cutter grinder wheel. Say you have a standard cutter grinder wheel that's about six inches in diameter. You take that six inch diameter wheel, multiply it by 3.141, which is pi, you're going to get an inch value of about 18 inches. Divide that inch value by 12, and you're going to get the footage of the periphery of that wheel, which is 1.570 feet. Therefore, take that 1.57 feet, multiply it by the standard RPM of a standard cutter grinder, which is 3600, it's going to give you the footage you've elapsed in one minute. Take that, multiply it by 60 minutes, and you get a very large footage number. Take that number and divide it by the foot equivalent of a mile, which is 5,280 and you're going to find that your cutter grinder wheel on its periphery is traveling at a ripping 64.247 miles per hour. So it's a good idea that you stand to the side of your cutter grinder when you turn it on, guys, because you don't want a piece of rock flying at you at 64.247 miles per hour. Take a case in point. Go out to the YouTube channel called the Slow Mo Guys. Watch them rip the crap out of CD ROMs and long playing records, and you can see how nasty those things get when they explode at high speed. So, therefore, stand to the side of your pedestal grinder when you turn it on. This is your friendly machine shop math guy saying stay safe out there guys and have a good day. This is your machine shop math guy signing off.